Okay. Right, this will be an interesting one if we can make this look good. I don't know how big we're going to make it. I think it'll probably be about 400 or nearly that. We'll see how we go. Come on. Oh, silly. Yeah, we're going that far with the contrast. Copy density. Going to lighten it a bit. Going to make it that much lighter. Okay, right. Let's see what else we can do with this. Um, we got here sculpture by the by the sea day trip so of course we're focusing on this image so swirling surround j j b j and cowie whatever it's an interesting piece i don't know what it's made out of it looks like little they look like they're meant to be little fishies anyway we're just going to quick press the buttons to make sure we have time to get our original on the glass i can just see through the um image through the paper so i just got to get that like so I think that's the way we pretty well want it to be just like that and the enlargement we don't know how big we're going to make this one exactly um we're going to go 400 for this and see what happens let's just hit that and hit that okay Okay, right, that looks interesting. We've cut a huge amount of it off, but that'll probably mean it'll make a better uh, mirror image. So I'm wondering if we're, where we're gonna make this the center. I'm thinking that's gonna be the center. That's what I was thinking. So this has been enlarged to the maximum size and that looks quite nice. You can see they are, I think, little models of fish whatever they're made out of they look almost like they're made of glass or some kind of transparent or translucent plastic not a bad looking sculpture actually not that i'm big on that sort of shit uh let's see how we go so out that one comes and we're going to put that one down there so we're just going to line this up, line up the corners as best as we can. So let's see how that goes. Like so, and we're just going to print off two more, which will be mirror images. Right, let's see how we go. Okay. Okay, let's see how that goes. Right, let's see how that looks. All right, let's just get this all lined up and looking good. I must admit the borders are quite large, but that's what you often get with enlarging 400%. And I think the mirror image makes the border there a bit bigger and the borders up there a bit smaller, which is annoying, but... Hey, that's just the way the fucking equipment was made. Not too much attention to detail by the Konica Minolta staff, I must say. Um, but then, surely the bosses would have told them not to fuss with it too much. Uh, whatever, it's just a stupid company, Konica Minolta. But anyway, we've made this stupid piece of corporate uh, mediocrity do something nice except we do have a bit of an overlap problem here which looks a bit shit it just looks really bad i have to just quickly maybe improve on this just by lining things up a bit better I'll just take a bit more effort here guys and girls and just line things up a lot better than what i just did 
It's not easy, folks. This is very difficult sometimes trying to get it pretty well just right to make it look really good for presentation to you all. So it still looks a bit crooked. I think we can pretty well call it quits. I think we can go.